Hey, welcome in, welcome in. My name is Adrienne Henderson Cole and I am a fashion consultant with Paparazzi Accessories where all the gorgeous fashion joy is $5. That's it, $5 just for you. So come on, let's get this party started right here on Facebook, right in the palm of your hand. You can shop. Hey, Melissa, welcome back in. I, I am, I don't know, I'm a little bit picky so I want things to be right. So I wanted to restart it, but I still have your basket, Melissa, with your things in it. So I'm going to go ahead and delete this live because I do not like that there's just the number 28 up there. I do not like that. So anyway, hey, friends, welcome back. Welcome back to the party today. I want to make sure everything is going good over here. Yep, much better. You can see my smiling face. I think that makes a big difference in um, people feeling comfortable. So if you're just joining in, my name is Adrian. I'm a fashion consultant with Paparazzi Accessories. We're going to hang out a little bit tonight, see some $5 jewelry. I'm starting with all the Valentine's Day items so you guys can check them out and maybe get something for yourself, okay? So 442 was the last one I showed before I got irritated with my platform. Here is 442. You have the heart earrings with those red rhinestones. Super cute. And that double heart is all that. Okay. Those are amazing. Those are number 442 with the hearts. Okay. And let me get a little banner going up there so we can uh, look. This one's cute, Melissa. Look at that one. <laughs> You can be a ninja shopper, okay? And let's see if I have a ticker. Uh, let me see if I can edit that and make it. Uh, hold on, I gotta fix that word. Scroll across the bottom. Here we go. And let's see, show. All right, there we go. That way your boyfriend won't know, your husband won't know, your shopping all you got to do is mute me and you will still be able to see the words going across the screen of the jewelry so you can still shop with the sound off all right here is number 423 this one i don't know if i showed this one before look at those cute heart earrings cute cute heart earrings and they are like a little charm charm like a locket almost, okay? And then you have these cute hearts down at the bottom. Each one has a pink rhinestone in it, okay? And each little heart has a little bit of a different design. So look at that one. Let me pull another one. They're all different and they're so cute, okay? And that one, look, see, it's a little bit different. Um, do you like that? <laughs> Isn't it cool? Then our husbands don't know what we're doing, right? So you can listen with the sound off. All right, so here is that heart necklace. I just have to I just have to make sure I talk clearly or else it won't sound right. All right? So this one is number 423. 423 in pink with those hearts with all the different designs on them. That is super cute, super cute. That is number 423, 423. Hold it up so you guys can see the number just in case, 423. All right, we are still on the heart theme. So here it is. Because you know what? They don't need to know everything we do. Do they need to know everything? No, I've been married for 26 years. He don't need to know everything. He don't need to know. All right, here we go. Number 343. Three. Love him to death, but you know what? I need to do what I do. Here's 343. Three. This is also a heart. You can see there's little tiny dots in there making that pattern, kind of looking like flowers. And then you have the matching heart earrings, okay? That is number 343. 343. Three. 215, 215, 215, 215 is the heart, humble heart necklace. Now I have 
silver and the other one is rose gold. Very simple, dainty necklace with this silver heart hanging down in the center. I'll show it to you on Nikki. All right, here we go. Melissa, you aren't out partying for Valentine's Day. What is going on, girl? You're supposed to be out partying with the hubby. Hold on. I got it. Bend down to the floor. Okay, here we go. That heart necklace. And look how long the extender is. So you can make it a short necklace as well. I love it when they do that because everybody doesn't like the short, short choker style, which it's definitely going to be. And then you have the cute little silver heart hanging right there in the center. Just turn it over so it can be a straight. All right. And that one is number 215. 215. And then 215. And then it also comes in rose gold. Rose gold. Here we go. Same design. You got that little tiny cute heart right there. Because I want to show you all the heart ones tonight, just in case you're still in the mood. I mean, it is February. It's also Arizona's birthday today. All right, so there is the rose gold one. All right, that is number 215, okay? 215. 215. All right, next we have 301, which is also a heart if you're just coming in. You know I'm Adrian, and I am your fashion consultant paparazzi. Here is the bangle bracelet that I have paired up with this heart necklace. Okay, it's in a burnished silver. Here is the bracelet. Okay, if you're just coming in, give me a hey, girl. Hey, here we go. Here is that bracelet. And then here is the necklace. You have your open heart earrings with filigree in them. Can you see the design? Let's look up close here. Here we go. There's the design, little flower on there. Isn't that cute? And then you got the burnished silver chain. And then here is the piece at the bottom. So the bigger heart actually hangs from the smaller heart, okay? So that is number 301. If you like the set, you can get the bracelet and the necklace together. Um, very cute, very cute. I don't always like to wear all the shiny silver. That's more of a muted silver, okay? 314. 314. Ooh. We have this pink moonstone heart, okay? And if you need to turn the sound off, you will still be able to hear what I'm saying because it does captions automatically. Here is the heart, right? Isn't that beautiful? And then you have the glass bead dangle earrings. All right, to go with that one. That is number 314. Only have two available of that. That would make a nice gift. Maybe you're going to work tomorrow or Tuesday and you want to have a gift for a coworker. Wouldn't that be a nice gift? Wouldn't that be a nice gift? I'm trying to turn the sound off on my phone. Hey. Uh oh, well, that didn't work. Hey, welcome oh. in. Anyway, hey friends, welcome can we back. Mute? Welcome can back. we turn the sound off? Thank you. Oh, yes. All right, good, good. All right, next one, 257. Now, if you like this one, I only have one exclusive piece left. One exclusive piece, and we have the key, the open heart key that looks like a locket, okay? That is number... 257. That is number 257. 257. Gorgeous. And then let's look at the earrings. The earrings are a clear, <clears throat> excuse me, dangle with that paparazzi rhinestone in there. 257. Okay. 390. If you like gunmetal, you'll probably love this set. It is gorgeous. We have the gunmetal rosy bracelet in a stretch. And then let me see. Let me get that necklace. 
The necklace actually matches it exactly. Here we go. The necklace has the same. Hey, Josephina, happy Valentine's Day, girl. Yes, yes. We have the rosebud earrings and then the rosebud necklace. I'll show you on Nikki. All right. I'll show you on Nikki. And then we have this gunmetal bracelet to match. Isn't that gorgeous? This is set number 390, set 390. What's going on, Josephina? Josie, what did you get for Valentine's Day? Or did you go out to dinner? We decided, <clears throat> Ed and I were going to go out. But then we decided to stay in because my parents wanted to come over. And so that was important to spend time with them. Excuse me. So uh, is that my neighbor, Irene Marquez? Girl, you're going to come and get your eggs. You can come on. Irene, they should be ready, I would say, Tuesday, okay? All right, Irene, I got you on that set, girl. They will be ready on Tuesday for you to pick up. Let me make you a basket. Yes, hi. <laughs> you know you pop in every once in a while. I'm surprised you haven't um, been shopping for your mom, right? What did you guys do for Valentine's Day? I was just telling we decided to stay home. Oh, cool, Josephina. I got flowers too, but I got flowers from my son. So special. You guys need to check out my Facebook page to um, see the flowers that he bought me. Okay? Because he it was amazing. Yes. And so we decided to stay here and we just did hot dog night. I did use, I don't know if you've ever done this, but I did um, I did French fries in the air fryer. Oh my God, they're amazing. And you guys are like hot dogs. Yeah, my husband loves hot dogs. So I just did different toppings. We did chili, we did cheese, we did relish, chopped onions. Um, and then I made the French fries and we had a salad. My mom made a salad and she brought that over. And that was what we did for dinner. But we just sat and talked at the table. And maybe that is what Valentine's Day is all about. Loving the people in your life, right? Can I get some hearts on that? Loving the people in your life. If it's your neighbor, Irene. If it's your fellow business per partner, Melissa. Love the people in your life, okay? Or your friend of a friend, Josie, right? Whoever else is out there. That's what it's all about. All right, so we're on to number 424. 424, look at this. This is one of my favorites. Double heart with the white rhinestones. If it had red, it would totally go with those earrings I showed earlier, but this is the white one, gorgeous. This is number 424, 424. And you can see it's got the white dangle rhinestones in there. And when I wore it on the show last week, I doubled it up, okay? So there it is. Isn't that pretty? That is number 424, 424. Mm -hmm. All right, we're moving on to the next Valentine's Day box, I think. And there might be some new things in here too, because the box did come today. All right, 121. 121 is the yellow earring. So yeah, these aren't Valentine's Day, but they're cute. 121, yellow moonstone earring with those big paparazzi diamonds. Gorgeous. Number 121, 121. Number 141. 141 is a magnetic bracelet. Are you guys still there? I feel like you're not there, but I'm still here. Let me check my page. Yep, it's still going. All right, one available of 121. This one is gray cord, and then you have the silver beads on it, and it's magnetic. So if there's anybody in your life that struggles with getting their own jewelry on. This is the perfect bracelet. One available of number 121 
Here it is. Super easy. Okay, because it was like dead silence. Well, I can't hear you guys anyway, but you know what I mean? All right. So here is number 121 with that magnetic clasp. Okay. One available of that one. 121. 421. This is a hot pink necklace. All right. Here is number 421. Gorgeous pink. Look at that. It is amazing. And now I paired it up with sorry, not sorry. So 421 is the pink necklace. And then here it is in a stretch. So no, it's not exactly the same, but you could get away with the hot pink on your wrist in a stretch. And then this one is number 421. Let's see if it has pink earrings. Sorry. Sorry, Charlie. It has white dangles. Okay. That's number 421. 421. 150 is new to Amazing Bling. It is blue. And like the other color, I think the other color is cyan, if that's the right word. I really think it is, but I'm not sure. How do you put your about you next to your name on my personal page? How do I put my about you next to my name? Let me look on my page. Let me see. Let me look. Personal page. All right, hold on a second. Do you mean where where it where it says like where I live and stuff? Where I live and my um what was I gonna say? Where I live and the name of my business? Is that what you're talking about, Melissa? All right, here is number 150, one available. It's got these gorgeous gray bead dangles, but of course, you could put on a silver hoop with these. And then you have the blue beads and big acrylic chunky fun ones, and then this color blue. So see, those two beads are not the same color blue and then gray. So it's a multi-color necklace because you're going to have both those colors in there. So here it is on... I have this necklace also in just solid gray, but this is the blue one. Super cute. And then I do have a pair of hoop earrings that totally mimic the shape on this necklace where you put AZ Mama. Oh, okay. I can show you how to do that with my little cactus and my chicken. Because <laughs> you guys know we have chickens in the backyard. I can show you how to do that, Melissa. Okay. Number 438, we have some pearls, I believe. All right, here it is. I don't know how I got so many of these. Oh, wait, wait, wait what is going on in this bag? Here we have this pearl and silver necklace. Silver necklace, silver earring, super pretty. That is number 438. Then I have this pearl and silver super delicate matching bracelet. So super classy. I'm trying to see what else is in here. I think I put a necklace. I did. I have another heart necklace. So this heart necklace has the same color beads. So that's why I paired them up together. So you have your pearls on one side. And then your heart on this side, okay? And then the beads on the bracelet and the earring match. So you could, like, style it up a little bit, all right? Because the earrings that come with the necklace are just the little pearl dangle. So you could take it up a notch with these right here and have a little bit of blank. So they have the same color pearls are in the earring that is in the necklace. And then you have your cute little heart pendant. This was one of my favorite necklaces because it's got the pearls just on one side gorgeous so that is set number four three eight four hundred thirty eight all right one zero four gorgeous new bracelet for a more casual style look at this look at this gorgeous cuff okay and these are the cuffs that i'll wear i don't wear all the cuffs 
but this one will definitely stay on. Like, I don't want my jewelry falling off my arm when I'm walking somewhere, right? So you got this cuff here. You can bend it to make it fit your wrist. We're going to pair that up with this crackle stone necklace right here. So you got your Wonder Woman crackle stone bracelet, okay? And I think I put some earrings in here. I sure did. Look, we have those earrings to go with it. Those are the chunkier teardrop, and they also have silver around the outside, okay? Then I also have a skinnier teardrop, depending on what your style is. So this is earring two. The skinnier one is earring two, okay? So you got to decide. Do you like earring two? I kind of like earring two better than earring one with this one, okay? So that's earring two. And then earring one were these. But it's totally up to you what you like. And then look, boom, the bracelet to go with it. Love that cuff, okay? So that is set 104. Here's that cuff again up close. All right. And that natural stone, okay? Two available of that necklace. I only have one of that gorgeous bracelet though, okay? One, 307, and Melissa, these are already in your basket, so don't be claiming these, girl, because these are cute. 307, gorgeous. Look at that. And you know what else I love? This is 307, and that baby pink, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And then look, it's not just flat. Can you see it's like on a surface? So it's got a little bit of dimension going on. And then it has the dangle earrings in the pink to match that heart. Okay. There it is. Isn't that gorgeous? You could just wear this for anything. I don't know. It's just pretty. 307. 307. All right. Do you like that one, Melissa? I like that one. All right. 341. Three, four, one. We have these pink wooden earrings. Okay. Those are number three, four, one. Super light, nice color. They're just going to pop out. Though, wasn't that heart gorgeous? That heart was gorgeous. Three, four, one on those. Okay. And four, four, four are these gorgeous chain link earrings. They look, they just make a chain and I'm gonna put them with a different necklace. I have that necklace out here. I'm gonna save these and show you how they're gonna coordinate with the necklace. The next earring is brand new. So get your fingers ready because it's gorgeous. I have it in two colors, okay? I'll show you the, the first one and then I'll show you the second one. All right, I'll show you the, the older one first, but they're both in the same style. This is number 275. I think 275. It's white and black rhinestones. And then there's also rhinestones going down the side of the teardrop right over there. Okay, those are number 275. Okay. I would totally wear these and be a princess for the day. Can you imagine you have your hair up and you got these on? People are going to be like, boom, look at you, girl. Look at you. Those are number 275. Here's the new one. I had to get them. They kind of look like they're pink and green, but they're purple and green. But they are so pretty. Here's number 275. Isn't that gorgeous? And I don't know. To me, it doesn't look purple. It looks more pink. Those are number 275. Those are gorge. Look, those are amazing. Okay, 275. If you're just joining in, we are seeing our $5 jewelry tonight. And everything is $5. Everything is fabulous. If you have never heard of paparazzi jewelry, you need to hang around and check out this bling and do a little shopping for yourself. When do we shop for ourselves? Uh, today I went shopping. Groceries. That wasn't for me. My son, when he was little, he's like, Mom, why don't you take a break and go to the grocery store? 
I just looked at him. Melissa for 275. Tell me which color, black or purple. All right, 135. One available of this red bracelet. It is a coil. Boom. So it's going to fit anybody. You just put it on, twist it around, and go. That is number 135. 135. 135. 213. 213. I think I have one of each color left. I have the red one and the pink one. Purple, please. Okay, I got you, Melissa. Aren't they just gorgeous? Aren't they just gorgeous? All right, these were the two I was trying to untangle yesterday but I should have untangled before tonight, but I didn't have time. All right, let me put Melissa's in her basket. That's the purple pair for you, dear, because they are gorgeous. And then I will show you these two heart, um, two heart necklaces in pink and in red. I forgot to take my medicine. All right, here is the red one. Red heart necklace with the white rhinestones in the center. That's what I'm saying. They go, that goes perfect with that other, um, that pair of earrings. And then that same necklace also comes in pink. They have decided to tangle themselves up right before the show, right? Here is the pink one. Same necklace. I'm going to see if I can get them untangled real quick. All I have to usually do is take one off of the card and they will come apart. But anyway, um, Melissa, did you share what you did for Valentine's Day? I shared what I did. What about anybody else? Anybody else want to share what you did for Valentine's Day? All right, let's see if we can get these two to leave each other alone. While I talk to you guys. And the other thing I could talk about is paparazzi. If you are thinking about being a paparazzi consultant, you need to message me because paparazzi is amazing. Amazing. Um, and it, you can have your own business. You can get the jewelry at a discount. And we have so much fun. Like $5 jewelry is just fun just because it's $5 jewelry. It's just fun. I get new jewelry all the time. Super exciting to open the boxes and see all the gorgeous jewelry and then show it to you guys. All right, so here's the pink one. So message me. Hey, Kathy, what's going on, friend? Here is the pink one, okay? You cleaned. Oh, okay. Well, at least you had a good dinner. All right, here's the pink one. I think the light is shining on it, but that's the pink one. Welcome in, Kathy. Welcome in. And then number 213 is the red one. So what I was saying, if you find yourself really loving the jewelry, you want to uh, have your own business, then talk to me, okay? Here is the red one. That is number 213. 213 in red or pink. Yes, at least you got to eat. I did clean a little bit too, but I was kind of like, you know what? I can clean tomorrow. I don't have to go to work tomorrow. I don't have to go to work. Kathy, I think this next earring is just you, okay? I only have three of this earring. I had to like get in, buy it, and get out. The jewelry sells out sometimes in seconds, right? In seconds it sells out, okay? So here is number 428. These gorgeous earrings, those are black feathers hanging from silver chain, okay? Gorgeous. Look, look, aren't they gorgeous? Those are number 428, 428. Those hair up girls, these will be rocking. Look at those, 428. Well, yes, you have to organize your bling, Melissa. You have to organize your bling. All right, we'll go on to the next box. Kathy, I thought those would be so your style. They just came in the other day. So 
So, Melissa, at least you still have one more day. One more day to get organized, okay? Number 302, I showed this one on Saturday. I want to show it again because I want to show it with the chain earrings, like how you got to think about the jewelry. So, here is this black. The number for the feather ones, Kathy, is 428. I totally thought they would be your style because I try and buy stuff with you guys in mind too. I can't just be buying all the pearls and diamonds for me. <laughs> okay, here is that necklace in the chain. Okay, you see the chain down there? That's why I was thinking these earrings that I showed earlier. All right, Kathy, I got you. Are, are perfect. Oh my gosh, okay. Now you got me sounding like a crazy person. Um, let me show you. Okay, so, and I'm totally going to put them together. I try and make sets, okay? So look, you got the chain earrings to mimic the chain in the necklace. What do you guys think? I think that's a good idea, okay? So this is set 302. And then I have a bracelet. This is the last one of the bracelet. Charm bracelet with the black and silver, and it's a stretch too. So this is set 302. If you want it all together, kind of edgy, right? You'll be cool. We can be the cool, hip, young people, even though we're all older and have kids and stuff. So that's 302, 302. I can still look cute, right? All right, 302, 302. And then let me make Kathy her basket because I'm totally going to put those two items together. Kathy's in the pink basket club. Give her a hashtag pink basket club, please. Give her a hashtag pink basket club. Hold on. I clicked on the wrong button. Can I see the necklace up close, please? Sure, Melissa, let me get Kathy's name on her card before I forget, because you know I forget everything. All right, here we go. Feather earrings. Let me put this up here. Okay. Now we are on to the necklace that Melissa wanted to see, the black one. All right, here is the black uh, necklace right here. So you got the black beads, and then it's black beads at the bottom with that chunky chain. Hey, Tina, what's going on, lady? Good to see you in the house tonight. All right, so that is number 302. 302. So that's the one you wanted to see. Melissa, everybody welcome Tina in. Can I see the necklace? Yep, I did that. All right, so that was set 302. I love it when stuff like that comes together. All right, 356, 356, 356 is a pair of pink earrings. They are so pretty, okay? 356, look, it's just pink rhinestones all the way around. And let's look at them up close. Here you go. Look, so you have the rhinestones all the way around. And this earring I love. Won't be on long. Yep, well, I'm off tomorrow, so we partying. Sorry you have to go to work tomorrow, Tina, but you know after the show I post an album of everything that I showed tonight. Well, not everything, but mostly everything. And then you can also check out the website, okay? So this is number 356. I was just saying I like these because... They're not super big, super delicate. Look how thin they are, right? And there is that hoop. Those are number 356, 356. Okay, you need some Moscato. I don't have any Moscato. <laughs> this is paparazzi, not paparazzi. <laughs> we can pop a cork on the rocks. Okay, Melissa. Melissa is partying. Okay, next we have number 212 in green. 
Okay, you guys might be like, green, but you can wear it, green, little green moonstones with a rhinestone. And then I just got in this necklace. This necklace is called What a Gem. If you like the more delicate dainty pieces, you need to get What a Gem. Okay, What a Gem is also a great gift. I can order this necklace anytime. People love it, love it, love it, okay? Here are the dangle earrings. So a little bit bigger of a rhinestone dangle. And then look, this is what's at the end of the chain. Look at that pop, okay? So this is called What a Gem in Silver, okay? Oh, sorry, you guys. And then here is the rhinestone up closer. Isn't it amazing? And then you have your dangle earrings. So what I was thinking is, if you don't want to wear those dangle earrings, this necklace is perfect. Goes with everything. You could totally be rocking those green and rhinestone hoops with that necklace too. And that makes a nice little set. So that, this necklace, what a gem. 212 necklace and then 212 earrings, okay? Or you can just get what piece you want. All right, but I did want to show you what a gem tonight. Melissa, have you seen what a gem before? It is amazing, amazing, okay? And then you could wear it with, I don't need a man to buy me jewelry, these earrings instead. Oh, that would look so classy, okay? So let me put this one back into her little delicate bag, delicate dainty necklace. It does have a, an extender on it. But that one for tonight is going to be number 212. 212. Hey, Tammy, welcome in, friend. Welcome in. Everybody give Tammy a little shout out. Here's Tina. Say, hey, Tina. There's Tina looking sassy. And then Tammy just joined in. Hey, Tammy. Uh, okay, here is number 134. This one just came in today because, you know, FedEx delivers on Sunday as well. This is number 134, 134. Love this simple, simple necklace. You have silver little beads on the side, and then you have the black beads, and then a black kind of gray acrylic bead as well. Simple chain. Look, let's see if we can do some double up. Perfect little double up action. You can make it two lengths, okay? Just play with your chain. Make sure it's laying nicely on your neck. You can pull it up tighter if you want. This is number two, sorry, number 134 in black. And then I have a pair of hoops. If they will come out of the bag. Cooperate, friends, cooperate. All right, here are the hoops. They are in a like a darker silver. And I'm going to put those with that necklace and boom. Because to me, they go with this bead right here. This gray acrylic bead totally complements the sheen and the shine in those hoops. So this is going to be set 134, 134. One pair available of the hoops, but I do have several of the necklace. All right. Tina, what did you do for Valentine's Day? Tammy, what did you do for Valentine's Day? What did you guys do? At the end of this box, we are going to play the timer game. So I hope you can hang around that long. Okay, another new bracelet in is number 441 in blue. I'm waiting for the blue necklace. It'll probably be here tomorrow. That totally coordinates with this blue but these are three stretch bracelets in blue okay so you're just gonna slide those on they are super fun that is gonna be number four four one uh well that's what we did here tammy we just stayed home we had hot dog night because i was like uh eh. We don't need to go out to dinner and spend a hundred dollars and then not have food for the rest of the week, right? 443 is a completely natural set. You have this gorgeous wooden uh bangle. Okay. So if you're a banger girl, this is all natural in wood. And then it has then I also have this bracelet. So this is like a little set in natural colors. 
And what else was I going to tell you? Oh, let me show you the necklace too. My boo came back to visit me. He lives in Phoenix. Oh, well, that's a great surprise, Tina. Awesome. Awesome. Tina, when are you coming back? When are you coming back, girl? You know it's cold where you are. <laughs> I love surprises. So I'm assuming you didn't know he was like going to turn around and come back for Valentine's Day. All right, here, this is number 443. These are the earrings. So you have this uh, natural cord and there are some wooden beads in that. And then it hangs down pretty long, but you can play with it to make it a little bit shorter. And then you have like this um, macrame kind of, I don't know what you call it, design, right? Hanging down and then more tendrils hanging down from the bottom. So you totally can have two bracelets on in this wood. All right, so this is number 443, 443. And I'm going to look at the necklace to see if you can make it shorter as well. 443, 443. Let me see what Melissa said. 443 for the set, Melissa. Okay, got you on that one. I still want to look at the necklace. Yeah, the necklace is, um, if you can see, well, not the thick bracelet. Okay, it's all totally up to you. The necklace is um, pull cord. If it'll pull, hold on. It might not be pull cord. Nope, it is not. You just put it on. I'm sure you could adjust it if you want. So, Melissa, I want to make sure I get you right. You want the necklace and the skinnier bracelet. This. Okay. All right, Tina, well, we'll wait for you. We'll wait for you, friend. Just don't come back in July, girl. You know it's hot then. All right, so the bracelet is still available if anybody's feeling the bangle in wood. That is a number 443. 443. All right, 447 is the turquoise sets. I put them all together last night just so you could have some options. So I have... The turquoise necklace. This is gorgeous right here. Yes, Melissa, I got you. And then the earring, the other one fell off the card, of course, is this one right here. The earring, I'll hold this up closer. The earring is the total same shape that is around the turquoise pendant. So that ties it all together. And the earring also, the necklace also comes with earrings too. So you can totally do this and do the turquoise set. That is the first one. And then I also have this turquoise set with a more oval shaped turquoise stone. And put them on here right so they can hang right. This is necklace number two. For set four four seven, I have a matching bracelet to go with that, and a ring. So I'm going to try and model those for you. Here is the bracelet and a ring. Okay, so this necklace also comes with earrings that match as well. Okay, so that is all together. So necklace two. This is necklace two. Okay, for 447 necklace two, here's the ring up close. If you're a turquoise person, hold on. There we go. Here's the ring. Isn't that gorgeous? That's the ring. And then the other necklace up close, so you can see that pendant, okay, is cute right there. Hey, Crystal, what's going on? Turquoise necklace, first one for set 447 necklace one for Melissa. So Melissa, this is necklace one. Just want to confirm. Crystal, Crystal, welcome in friend. Necklace one for Melissa. Give me a yay or a nay on that. All right. And then there's the silver earrings that have the same design that is on the necklace. Okay. All right. Just watching NASCAR, you tell your husband he better have got you roses today. Did he get you roses or not? 
All right. And how's everybody in your house doing, Crystal? You know, we always got to talk about COVID. That's the topic of conversation for the last year. Here is set 239, 239. And look, gorgeous in brass. We have the brass ring. Okay. Oh, I love grilled burgers. All right, here is the bangle set that goes with it. All right. All right. Good. I'm glad everybody's doing better. How is Cecilia's eye? I worry about her every day. Worry, worry, worry. All right. 239 also has its own earrings in that brass. So if you are a brass girl, you're going to love this piece. 239. 239. All right, let's play a game. Let's play the timer game. We'll play the timer game. And someone is going to win some free bling tonight. Today hasn't been too good. Okay. You tell her I said hello, okay, if you see her. I don't know if she's already in bed or whatever. Um, for the timer game, we're going to comment with our favorite drink. Mine is, for the moment, not right now, but in the morning coffee. So I'm going to set the timer with Siri and you're going to comment and we're going to get this game going and someone's going to win some free bling on your mark. Get set, go. You'll be the cheerleader. Yes. Crystal has to be the cheerleader too. Remember if you are a consultant, you can't play. Well, you can play. This is what I did before, Melissa. If you're a consultant and you're joining the live, that is amazing. Feel free to hang out. You can play, but then you have to give it to somebody, okay? So, Melissa, that's what we did before. So, you can comment and you can play, but you got to give it away to who anybody who is on the live tonight. So, comment with your favorite drink. And I'll get the next box ready. My husband's out there cracking up at his TV show. Right? Yeah, Crystal knows the rules. Crystal, you're going to MP, EMP, right, girl? Right? Very, very hibiscus. Where do you get that, Kathy? Melissa said it, too. Where do you get this drink? Is it Starbucks? And then Melissa with her Moscato again. Black iced tea, unsweetened. Really, Tammy? You can drink it with no sweetener? Hmm. You're tougher than I thought, girl. Ah, Starbucks. Okay, I'll have to try it. Is it sugar-free? Black coffee. Tammy, Tammy, you scare me, man. You got hair on your chest. <laughs> With black coffee and black tea. All right, we're waiting for that timer. I'm not going to look at it. Well, I kind of have to look at it because it's not going to make noise. All right, Tammy's in with the black coffee. Crystal's in with the coffee. We'll see. Whoever's name pops up after the timer goes off is the winner. And remember, it's on my side, not your side, okay? Because sometimes the comments are off. All right, so the next person is... The timer just went off. Did I silence it? I'm waiting for the next name to pop up. Nothing's popping. Did you guys comment? Oh, there it is. Kathy. Woohoo. Kathy is the winner. Kathy is the winner. The winner of the free piece is Kathy. Woohoo. All right. Let me put a sticker. Do you want the ones that are already in your basket for free, Kathy? Well, you don't have to decide. You can always keep shopping. But I'll put the sticker in there so I don't forget. Here, I made these stickers. Kathy is the winner. Okay, so she gets a free piece of amazing bling. All right. Thank you, Kathy. And thank you for sharing that drink with me, guys. Okay. I just want to know if it's sugar-free. All right. Number 381. 381. We have these pink and blue tassel earrings. I showed these the other day. These are number 381, 381. I want to look for hearts. Let me see. 
if you are a gold girl excuse me we have number 211 in gold it's that flared out or fluted kind of gold earring it's not but it's super good okay well maybe i'll have a cheat day because we're going to aruba in june as a family a girl need to lose some pounds like i'm trying to lose 50 pounds by june i think i can do it because this is not me this <laughs> this is corona <laughs> Okay, so here is number 211 in gold, brand new to the Bling Boutique. So if you're a gold girl, you might want to snag those hoops. We know we all love some hoops in gold. And then 402, we're almost done with like the Valentine's Day stuff, and then we'll move into the regular Bling. Number 402 is this red heart pendant with the rhinestones all the way around. It has, what color are the, the dangle earrings are the white ones for that set, okay? Here it is. Red heart, gorgeous. Simple necklace, perfect gift for somebody. You gotta be thinking like, to me, this one could also be good for Mother's Day as well, okay? All right, that is number 402. 131 is the pink necklace, double strand, you guys. We usually don't have a necklace with double strands, but this one has two rows of the pink pearls. This is number 131. We have the pink pearl dangle earring, and then you have the pearls and then the clear faceted acrylic beads as well. That's number 131. 276 is the heart necklace. Crystal already has this one, but this is the super, most superest, I don't know, superest is not a word, right? The gold heart necklace, okay? Hammered texture, it, and it, look, look at the cute little earrings. This is number 276, and let me show you the silver one. So you have two choices. You have gold and you. it comes in silver. This one is a choker style necklace. Isn't it the best necklace ever, Crystal? And what? I put an extender on it, made it drop down a little bit. It does have an extender on, but it definitely is a choker style necklace, okay? So that is the silver one. This is number 276. And I'll show you the gold one one more time. I love it. I love it. I was going to wear it tonight, but we're in a challenge, right, Crystal, to wear Z pieces. So I'm wearing my Z tonight. All right. So here is the gold one, same necklace. And you can see on this one, it's got the extender all the way out. So you can see it can hang down a little bit lower. All right. That is number 276 in silver or in gold. Where did I put that sticker? Oh, okay. All right. Number 303. Gorgeous bracelet, silver chain with that white rhinestone right on the front. That is number 303, 303. All right, let me put these to the side and get situated up front. It is very, very, very cute. <laughs> I love that necklace. When I saw it first come out in gold, I was like, I hope they come out in silver because I'm a silver girl. Okay. 101. We have some pink. We have a pink bracelet in stretch. Two together. Here it is. It's a nice pink set. This is bracelet 101 with the pink and the hematite colored. Um, I would say they're gunmetal, right? Gunmetal and pink bracelet. Okay. That bracelet also comes in black. Here is the black one. All right. Same as the pink one. So you can say 101 pink or black. And I have a pink necklace or a black lanyard that could go with those. 
<laughs> here is the black here's the pink necklace so it's got the um the pink like little feathers i guess you could call them feathers but the pendant has that pink bead right in the center which is the same and coordinates well with the pink beads that are on the bracelet you can see and then you have the pink earrings as well so that bead right there on the bracelet is the same as the bead in the necklace that is number 101 if you need a lanyard i put this black lanyard in to go with the black bracelet okay same kind of bead pattern and there's your lanyard hook if you wear a lanyard at work I also put my mask on my lanyard when I'm running around doing errands so I don't have to dig down in my purse to find my mask, okay? All right, here we go. We got some red. This is the last one of this red set. All right, and this is gorgeous, gorgeous. Here we have the short red necklace. You have the chain hanging down, gorgeous. And then you got this bracelet right here that is the same design that is in the necklace. So that makes it the perfect matching set. I'll put that right there for a second. And then you can decide on your earrings. Now the necklace does come with earrings with super tiny dangles. I thought these would be a good match. This is earring one, silver oval shape and it has little chunky red rhinestones right at the bottom that coordinate with the rhinestones and the bracelet and the necklace if you don't like that shape earring that's earring one earring two we have a red rhinestone dangle all right that's cute as well so it's totally up to you guys this is earring two earring two here is earring one in the red and that is 102, and then the bracelet and the necklace to match, okay? That is 102, 102. 103 is yellow. And I remember, Kathy, you were looking for yellow, but I didn't have the yellow one you picked, I don't think. Yeah, so this is a different yellow one. So this one has the yellow moonstone. This is number 103. This is a one of a kind right here in this yellow, all right? And those are like, they're not exactly moonstones. I would say it's a nice, clear kind of acrylic bead, all right? And that is number 103. I don't have any neon yellow. There, I did a while ago. I might have one. I'd have to look. It might be in the closet. I'll have to look, Melissa, and see, okay? They, for EMP last year, one of the pieces was neon yellow. So I hope you're signed up for EMP, my friend. Okay? I don't, I can't remember what you said when we were talking about it. 105 is a blue necklace. And then I have these blue beads blue bead bracelet to match. This is a hinge bracelet. So it opens right on the side. Okay. And then here is the necklace. That's number 105, 105. 105. All right. 106. Red earring and a black earring in this bag. Both the same style. They are so super light that it's amazing. But you guys know paparazzi jewelry is lead and nickel free, which means that it's super lightweight, right? Super lightweight. So let me see. I want to change my banner for a moment to say this. Okay. And we're going to do pink. Okay. Here we go. Here's the next earring. Super lightweight, even though it has all those dangles hanging down, it comes in black and it also comes in red. And it's not like a screaming your face red. They are like um, clear acrylic beads, okay? Those are super cute, all right? That is number 106. Kathy is claiming the bracelet, number 105. 
Cute bracelet, friend. Cute bracelet. Give her a hashtag pink basket club because she is definitely in the club. Number 108. We have the knotted bracelet in silver and in gunmetal. I'll show you the silver one first. Here's the silver one. So you have that cool knot, okay, on the front. Here's what it looks like. There is the silver one. This is number 108. That's the silver one. Then it also comes in super silky, sexy gunmetal, okay? So that is number 108108. Hey, Juju, what is going on? We are seeing our $5 jewelry tonight. My name's Adrian. Welcome in, welcome in. If you want to claim something, all you have to do is comment with the number 109. 109. Here is this pink pendant. Love this one. It is nice and big. You have your long chain. I You could double it up because you have that jump ring right there. Okay. But I don't know if I would do that. It's got pink dangles and I'll show you on Nikki so you guys can see. Here it is in pink. Isn't it pretty? Yep, pretty, pretty, pretty gorgeous. That is number 109. Remember, you guys, all the jewelry is what? What? Five dollars, five dollars. All right. Sometimes I can't believe it. Some of the pretty stuff, right? Like that pink heart necklace. Can we talk about the pink heart necklace? Oh my gosh, gorgeous. All right, one zero one ten. Number one ten is next. 110, we have the silver earrings. These are so pretty. These are so pretty. I guess I'm going to have to remove you from the show if you're going to be inappropriate. That's okay. All right, here we go. Here is number 110. 110, silver earring. All right, and it's got that foil kind of look texture. These have a little bit of weight to them, but I love them because I love a big, simple earring, but it's got some character as well. So that's 110. And then I paired it with this necklace right here, which I'll show you on Nikki. It's got the brown stones in it, but you barely see them. So I would say you could wear this necklace with anything. Okay. And then here are the earrings. Um, what happened here? All right, that is number 110, 110, 110, gorgeous. I feel like the earrings kind of like mimic the teardrop shape that's on the necklace, and then you have that silver chain, 110. Oh yeah, sometimes people pop on and they're inappropriate, and then you have to block them. So someone popped on and they were inappropriate, so I blocked them, so. You, you just get used to it. Some people are just evil, right? 111, love, love, love this bracelet. Okay, looks like little chiclets, right? But look, boom, opens just like that. It is a hinge bracelet. This is number 111 in white. This is gonna be so cool for the spring. Because you guys might not have seen the comment because it came from YouTube. Because I'm live on YouTube right now as well. So this is number 111. 111. But you just got to keep rolling with it. Whatever. You want to come on a live video and be inappropriate? Okay. You're so cool. <laughs> right? All right. 112. We have these brass hoops. All right. 112 in brass. All right. Those are really cute. And to me, they look like they have a little like feather or fern leaf pattern on the front. They have a little bit of weight to them. So if you do get these, I always include the back. Can you see that back that has that um, plastic disc on it to give you a little bit of support? All right, Melissa, I got you on 111, which is Melissa's back. It's over there. That white bracelet is everything to me. I think it's pretty cute. It's hard to find white jewelry sometimes, you guys. 
All right, 113, 113. We have this red necklace, and I probably should put that red bracelet with this red necklace. And I don't know if I can, it was in the very, here it is. Look how fast I am. Okay, so here is the red necklace. This one is super pretty. This is number 113. And then earlier I showed you, Nikki, be still. Number 133, 133 coil bracelet, but it would be perfect with this red necklace. Now the red on the bracelet is a little bit deeper, right? A little bit darker red. All right, but it's still red. So it kind of goes. So this is number 113 for the necklace, 135 for the bracelet. And then the necklace has some bead earrings as well. Little dangle red beads. Oh, 114. Where's my pink friends? 114. Here we go. 114. A long pink necklace. I think it's pretty. All right. So you have the opaque pink faceted dangle beads on a long chain. So it's going to hang down long in your neck. Probably not a good double up candidate, but we could try it. All right. So here is the necklace. Okay. And then, yeah, it's got like three skinny chains at the bottom. So I wouldn't double that one up. I do have a cute little earring to go with it in pink. I should just keep earring backs like on my body because the earring is not hanging on the card for me. I'll show you one of them. Here is 114, 114. So it is a pink a bead in the center with those white rhinestones going around the outside. And then the necklace has its own earrings as well. So you have, this is 114 again. And then here are the earrings that go with that. All right, for number 114. All right. 114, 115. I'm gonna have to get my music together because I need a little bit of music going on, guys. We gotta, I got, I'll work on that tomorrow since I'm off. Okay, 115. We have these silver hinge earrings. Very pretty with that flower in the middle, flowers going all the way around. And those are gonna hang down long. And that's number 115. And then I also have this stretch bracelet to go with those earrings. I don't know, I kind of felt like the beads and the texture kind of coordinate with each other. So that's 115, 115, 116, 116. We have the red stopping traffic, which would be great for Valentine's Day. Here is the red, those red rhinestones. Very cute. That earring also comes in white and hot pink. Let's see if they will cooperate today. Here are the pink ones. Super cute. Pink. And then there's silver on the back. All right. Those are number 116. And then the last color that earring comes in is silver. Let me pull the silver ones out. The silver ones are bling blinged out okay but i don't think they're too much like you know we still got to go to work every day i don't think they're too much so here they are number 116 116 gorgeous gorgeous okay 117 are the earrings that i have on aren't these hot these are hot i wear these earrings all the time here they are 117 you have those. Aren't they gorgeous? I don't need to hold them up to me because I'm wearing them and they just pop out and they are gorgeous. These are number 117. 117. All right, you guys. 118. And yeah, I have on this fancy necklace, but I wear these earrings just to work because they're cute. 118. We have rose gold and silver. 
super fun. All right, here is the, let's see, the rose gold one. It's like a 3D ball or sphere, okay? In rose gold, double chain right there. And then the little circle earrings, that's number 118. This is gonna be a short necklace. So if you don't like it up that high, you are definitely gonna wanna use that extender for number 118, okay? 118. And then here is the silver one. Same design, except you have the silver chain. All right, you guys? You guys all right out there? Let's talk about what is our favorite candy. My favorite candy is Good and Plenty. So in addition to my gift card, oh, did and you know what? Vietta never told us what she got as her gift from her boo or her bae, as she calls them. She never told us. I told you guys I got a Starbucks gift card and a DSW gift card. Oh, and my mom got me my favorite coffee mug. It's the green M&M because I broke it. Or did I break it? Or did somebody in this house break it? I can't remember. Here's number 119 in a cuff in black. Let's see your favorite candies, you guys. 119. All right, one, 120 is definitely one of my faves. One of my faves is this standard silver hoop. Okay, I keep them separate because everybody loves these. Everybody loves these. Everybody needs one of these hoops, okay? Here they are, number 120. 120. See this hoop right here? Just a regular hoop, kind of chunky, okay? That is the silver one. And I don't know why they are messing up on the card, but that is the silver one. These are hot, okay? And then there is the gold one. That's number 120 in silver or in gold. Gorgeous. So if you need a good hoop, I have three of the silver ones and one of the gold pair left. I love those just because they're a little bit chunkier. All right, one Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. You got it, Tammy. That's right, girl. That's a, I, Tammy, Reese's Peanut Butter Cups in Vanilla Ice Cream, bomb.com, okay? Number 122, this one you might be thinking about for Mother's Day. Um, doo -doo. Let me see. The, it got, it's tangled up, but I'm going to show it to you guys anyway. This one says, always a mother, forever my friend. Okay, so it's got that cute heart with the pink rhinestones. It's on a long chain, but these two have decided to co-mingle in the bag. Hey, Mardia, what's going on? Welcome to AZA TV, girl. Do you see me looking fabulous? It's a little late for you out there in Florida, friend. Um, who else has their favorite candy? And that's just us being total gluttons, right, Tammy? Putting those Reese's peanut butter cups in vanilla ice cream. But you know what? I might be having that tonight because the diet starts tomorrow. Like I really started my diet on, what day did I go to the doctor? Um, Thursday. That's when I started my diet. But then it was Valentine's Day, so we just ate whatever. So I'm starting fresh on Monday. I mean, I didn't like overeat. Almond Joy and Mounds. Yeah, Kathy, I can't get with you on that coconut, girl. Can't get with you on the coconut. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna, I am going to get back on the train first thing in the morning. I was talking to my husband. I was like, come on, we could like exercise this stuff outside because it's nice outside now. He's looking at me like I'm crazy. So I'm like, whatever. All right. So these necklaces are not cooperating. Let me see if I have one more to show you. Yes, I have one in here that is not tangled. So again, these say always a mother forever, my friend. And we got the pink heart. These are number 122, 122 chocolate covered strawberries. I can't get with the, the cup, chocolate covered fruit and frozen custard. I can get with the custard. Are you going to put your chocolate covered strawberries in the frozen custard? 
All right, let me see. So first we had Tammy. She's decided the favorite candy is Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. I totally give her a vote for that. And then we had Kathy with the Almond Joy and Mounds. I told her I can't get with the coconut, but I can get with those almonds. And then Mardia's favorite candy is chocolate covered strawberries. Oh, and frozen custard. And the frozen custard is not a candy, but since we're combining candy with ice cream, why not put those chocolate covered strawberries in that frozen custard, right? Okay, so then here is that pendant. So you can see it is long. It does have the tiny jump ring right there. When I say jump ring, it's a circle. And you can hook the necklace into that to make it uh, shorter as well. So this is a great gift. And you've got the dangle earrings as well. So that's number 122. I have three available of that. Oh, it's blended together. Okay, okay. That's a specialty, right, Mardia? All right, 123. We have these gold earrings. They are quite the statement piece. Uh-huh. And those earrings also come in silver. These are number 123. Um, let me show you the silver ones. There's 123 in silver. Uh, Tammy is going to claim 122. All right, Tammy, did I make you a basket, girl? I don't think I did. But I love that necklace. Let me make you a basket. Hashtag Kapinga Basket Club for Tammy. Because earlier we had on, well, Melissa's still here. Um, Irene was on earlier. And I think that is Kathy's basket right there. So this one is going to be Tammy's. Oops, sorry, guys. Looking for my marker. That's how I stay organized. Uh, Lint. Okay. Yeah, that's a good one, too. All right, Tammy. It's a nice gift. Or it could be for you, girl. All right, so we were on the gold earrings with the... Where did I put it? Oh, it's over here. So I showed you the gold and silver ones, but I also have this gold choker that I put in the bag with those earrings. It has the rhinestone there, and then it's just rhinestones all the way around. One available of this choker, because I always believe if you wear a small necklace, that means you can put on some big statement earrings in that gold and that choker. Okay. So that's number 123. Remember those earrings also come in silver. If you are a silver girl, no more silver choker. That one sold out a while ago, friends. All right. 123. 124 is a lanyard with the glass beads. So I don't know if you guys, I wear my lanyard every day to work. I just want to know that when I put it on, I have my keys for work. Sure, Melissa, hold on one second. Here's 124 with glass beads and the land your hook. You just got back on, what happened? Why are you apologizing, girl? This is a friendly place. All right, 123, these are the earrings. Here's the gold ones. Boom, love it. All right, and then here are the silver ones. Here's the silver ones. All right. They are on a post back and they are going to make a statement. They're probably going to hit your shoulder, guys, because they are long. All right. That's number 123. All right. 125. This is a gorgeous one. 125. I'll sh it comes in two colors. I'll show you the green one first. If you are a green girl, oh my gosh, this necklace, gorgeous. 125. One available in green, okay? And it's got matching earrings. Somebody loves this piece right here. Isn't that nice? Um, and then it's gonna hang right there. That's 125. So I also have that necklace in, I can't remember whether it's purple or pink. I think it's called purple. 
125 in purple. Here it is, the purple. Gorgeous, gorgeous, okay? Gorgeous. And the earrings match. And with the purple one, I happen to have scored the matching bracelet. Here it is right here, okay? It's a cuff bracelet with that same, look at that, look at it, how it hits the light. Same thing is going to happen with the necklace. Oh my gosh. Number 125, green or purple. There's only one available of each necklace, okay? Let me know who is going to bake that into their basket. I think it's gorgeous, gorgeous. It's got an extender on it. I would probably drop it down just a little bit. I like to wear V-necks and I want it to fit right inside. Kathy, Kathy scored that purple one. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my gosh, girl, you are going to be looking fabulous. Look, gorgeous. Guys, Kathy scored it. She's got 125 in the purple, okay? That is a gorgeous piece. The green is still available. <laughs> Melissa, remember, and for anybody that's watching, if you're hanging out with your boo, you can put me on mute and it'll be closed captioned across the bottom. And that way you can just be like, oh, I'm just scrolling Facebook and you're actually watching the show. Okay, so 125, the green one is still available. 126. Kathy, you're going to love that necklace. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for you, girl. 126 is a silver hoop earring. <laughs> yeah, Melissa got Melissa got caught. <laughs> here is it wasn't a beautiful Vienna. Still have the green one, girl. All right, here is these earrings. In that earring, there is a little black bead. Can you see it in there? Okay, I love these because it's a wider teardrop. Isn't that pretty? Those are pretty as well. Those are number 126. 126. Kathy, you scored tonight. You got the feather earrings, girl. And you got a free piece. You are just on fire. She is on fire. All right, you guys. Let me get to our last box of bling for tonight. Oh, and this is a new item. I don't know if anybody likes the wooden jewelry. This bracelet, I know. <laughs> I know. I was thinking about you, but like I like organize the jewelry and I show different pieces. I don't want you guys to come on and then see the same jewelry over and over. So I like I don't know. I'm just I just have to be systematic. So here's the bracelet that I just got in yesterday. Completely wooden brown beads with those white beads. I would say they're tan and it's a stretch bracelet, okay? Totally for your trip to Aruba, Jamaica, Hawaii, or hot, hot Arizona, right? So this one you can just say brown bracelet if you are feeling this one because it just came in. I haven't even had time to put it into the catalog, okay? All right. 127. 127. We have Crackle Stone again. I feel like you guys may have seen this bracelet, but you know what? Sometimes we need a second and third look to really get our, um, decide what our jam is, right? So here is the necklace, matching bracelet. You have the crackle stone in there, okay? That one is number 127. Then you have some earring choices. I showed you these earrings earlier. The necklace does come with earrings, little nuggets. And then here is the other earring that I have. Teardrop, you could do that. I also have this square earring. All right. These also have that crackle design in them as well. Silver setting with that square shape. So those are number 127. 127 square, 127 teardrop, or, and then there's the necklace and the bracelet all in 127, 127. So for this week, let me tell you what's going on. Tomorrow's Monday. 
Um, I will do my two lives. I do one at six and I do one at 6.30. We also have the messenger party, not six, not six. Let's be clear, 6.30, as long as I'm up. I don't know, I slept in today. Yes, these are crackle stone and they are square and they are sassy. Love them. They're about the same size as the earring I have on. Yep, they are crackle. All right. So, yeah, I don't know if it'll be 6 or 6.30 because I'm off. It might be 7.30 or 8. So we'll see. Depends on what time I go to bed tonight. 128. 128. We have this lanyard with that hammered texture in it. And there is your hook for your ID or your keys. Here are, is the necklace. You could also be thinking like, most people are like thinking like work. What if you're like, go to the grocery store, hook your keys on here. You know how we always be digging in our purse, looking for stuff, okay? That's number 128, 128. Melissa, let me know if you want those um, crackle stone earrings. 129 is this pearl necklace. This is one of our favorites. It's called a blockbuster because it's always available. So the beauty of this is if you want more than one, you can get as many as you want. I always have this necklace available. This is number 129. It's called Designated Diva. You got your pearls, your silver ovals, a little rhinestone cap bead, and then all these dangles. All right. No biggie, you know me. I am flexible. Here are the earrings that go with it. Yes, they're gorgeous. And the shape is what makes them. So that is number 129. Now with 129, I have these pearl stretch bracelets. Okay. These pearl stretch bracelets that you could pair up with it have one little accent bead on them with the silver and the black rhinestones, that's number 129. Or you could go with this stretch bracelet and pearl, okay? Remember, stack your bracelets together. Look, you can do all kinds of things with the bracelets, all different colors. Just wear a whole little grouping, okay? That is number one, 129, 129. All right, let's see. What else can we talk about? How can I get to know you guys better? Okay, everybody, post in the comments. If you want to, you can use an emoji. How many kids do you have? Okay, how many kids do you have? I And I'll try and do it on my phone. Let me see if I can comment too. All right, let me see if I can comment on the live and put how many kids I have. All right, let's see. I think I can do it with an emoji. Nope, you can't. How'd you do that, Vietta? How'd you do that? Hey, Troy, come on in. Vietta, I gotta steal your emojis. Okay, let me see if I can do it from my notes. All right, you guys. What we're doing right now is everybody is posting how many kids they have with an emoji. If you don't have anything, you can post a goose egg. Now I can't find what I'm looking for. Notes. I know I have it in my notes. Let's see if I can do this. Is it not going to do it? It's not doing it. Troy, what is that? Is that a goose egg? It's not even posting. I thought I could totally do this. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. I can't do it. See, it's stupid, stupid. I, I try to be cute and I can't even do it. And I wanted to participate. Kathy put up one finger. See, you guys are able to do it. I can't do it. All right, let's see. Tammy, I see two kids. And the, yeah, Troy has goose egg. 
but he's a great guy. Just because you don't have kids doesn't mean you're not amazing, right? And then Vieta, I see four boys and a girl. Let me show you guys. Hold on. Because it was so cute. Maybe you guys can't all see each other. There's Vieta. She's got four boys and a girl. Melissa has six kids. Troy has the goose egg. And then Kathy has one child. And then from Tammy's picture, I'm assuming two kids, right? All right. And I have two boys. So, yes, let's try and learn about each other. Have a little bit of fun. Here's the next lanyard with the flower. Gorgeous silver lanyard with the matching tassel earrings. All right. That's number 130. 130. Troy, are we doing coffee tomorrow? What's going on? We haven't talked in the morning in forever. That will give me motivation to go to bed and get up. Okay. Oh, 132. You guys, this one is a gorgeous one. There is only one available. Melissa's claiming 130. All right. I'll get you that lanyard, girl. Super cute. All right, and then here is the blue and gunmetal necklace. This is number 132. Love those blue beads with that gunmetal setting around with the blue earrings. I know you guys are like blue, but whatever. Just branch out. This is number 132 in blue. One available, guys. One thirty-three, pink, 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 with the bling. Those are so gorgeous. One thirty-three. That's when when I see things like that. That's where I'm like, five dollars. So these earrings, these earrings are five dollars. Look at all those rhinestones, and look, it swings, and it's got the pink moonstone. They're gorgeous. Okay. Here is a necklace with that same pink moonstone. The necklace does not exactly match. I mean, see, to me, the necklace is a little bit darker, but then again, the necklace won't be on your earlobe. It'll be hanging down. So isn't that cute together? That is set 133. I have two pair of the earrings available and one necklace, 133, 133. 136 is my favorite red necklace. It is so much fun. All right. You have those big silver beads, those big red ones, and then the clear acrylic beads. And then look, you got your fun red earrings too. That's number 136. This one is super fun. I love this necklace. Okay. 136, 136. When I say I love it, you guys are supposed to know that's code for, that is code for, um, I own this necklace. Okay. That's what that code is. Okay. Uh, all right, here we go. Here we go. Let me take off my, I'm trying to take off the ticker. There we go. All right, so this one is number 136, 136. Gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, let me see. There's a comment over here. Code. I forgot what my joke was, but. All right, let me put some of these away real quick. 136. 133, 132. So we now know what everybody's kids are. Let's share what our job is. What is your job? I am a teacher. I teach first grade. I teach completely online for the school year. And I'm good with that. What do you guys do? Code or yes, yes. Re thank you for reminding me, Melissa, because like I forget sometimes you you guys are like five seconds behind me and it takes me that quick to forget what I said. <laughs> All right. So let's share our jobs. Let's share our jobs. Working at a gym and daycare. What gym do you work at, Vieta? 
137 is also a lanyard. You have the silver earrings. They have a little bit of texture on them. And then these gorgeous big rings. And then there's your lanyard hook at the bottom. Front office at the elementary school. Yes, Tammy, I knew that. You are the master of the universe. Tammy is the master. Melissa is a receptionist making her dreams come true. Right, Melissa? All right, here is that, that lanyard. I believe all I have left are the lanyard. This is the one where I get like mixed up with my bag. But let me show you. Okay, 137. Let's see if there is a necklace. There is one necklace available of this gorgeous piece. The rest are lanyards. But if you really like it as a necklace and you want it to be a necklace, you can just um, take the lanyard hook off. Right, Troy? They run everything. DC train like a pro. Is that a gym in PG County? I know where you live, Vieta. Remember, I used to live there. I never heard of that place before. Okay, here is the earrings. 137, 137, instructional aid and preschool and aid around the school at other times. You and Tammy are ninjas. Yes. Here are those earrings. 137, 137, gorgeous. Simple hoop, but just goes with anything. Okay, Viet, I never heard of that. I know where K Street is. Look, I know where everything is. I grew up in Prince George's County. Viata, have you lived there all your life? Because we could talk about some things from back in the day. All right, so that was 137, and I showed you that earring. Let me put this one back on the card. Um Here is that earring, simple silver hoop, but you always got to have a good hoop, ladies. So this is number 137. It's got a little texture on that hoop. You can see that flattened spot right in the front right there. Super cute. So that's number 137. 137. 139. We have this bracelet, gorgeous, okay? So now everybody knows a little about, a bit about each other. We have our receptionist, and we have the master Jedis, Tammy and Kathy, that run the whole school. Troy is a vice principal, but he knows they run the school. And then Vieta works at a gym and a preschool. Multitasking people. All right, here is um, number 139. Black and silver nuggets with the two bead. There are two bracelets in this set and they stretch, okay? And then we have this earring. Yes, VIP and life coach and bling boss. So you got three jobs. Tree jobs, Mon. He's got tree jobs. 139. Gorgeous. Number 139. Vieta. What high school did you go to? Maybe we know each other. All right, number 139. I went to Eleanor Roosevelt and Largo High School. 139. 140. We have a silver necklace. Okay, this is the one I told you where it is in printed. Oh, you went to Bowie? We probably saw each other. Okay, so Vieta. What year did you graduate from Bowie? Here is the silver one. All right, you have the texture with the roses. Okay, and then there's little cage beads on there as well. This is a short necklace. Yes, Troy, I am off tomorrow. Are we gonna have a power hour together? Here is that necklace. This is number 140, super pretty, 2001. Vienna, I'm a little bit older than you, girl. I graduated in 85, 1985. Okay, here is number 142. So, Vieta, I was probably your babysitter. <laughs> 142. 142. We have two bracelets. 
okay? Number 142. We have the silver with the purple moonstones. Kathy, Kathy, it's calling your name. This is number 142, all right? And then we have that same bracelet with the gray moonstones. Gorgeous, all right? Last two available of those. I have one purple and one gray, okay? There they are. Number 142, 142. Yes, we had a 2001. We had a, in 2001, I was already teaching first grade. Um, I had gotten my master's degree from college and you were just a little high school baby. Oh, so cutie cutie. <laughs> just teasing girl, just teasing. Okay, 143 is Scarf for Attention. You guys have seen this necklace. I know you have, but maybe you need a refresher. It comes in three colors. Here's the gunmetal one, gorgeous. This is the necklace that you can wear five ways. If you don't have one of them, you need to get one. You got your tassel earrings, you have your gunmetal chain, and then here is the silver one. Here's the silver one. Okay. But you know, as you get older, Vieta, right? You can be friends with anybody of any age. Doesn't even matter anymore. It's not like when we were in high school. So here's the silver one. So you can see gunmetal, silver, and then I have it in gold. All right. Let me show you the gold one. Troy, did you get my package yet? It's been like five years. Okay. Here is the gold one. All right, and with the gold one, I have this gold bracelet that you can totally pair up with it. And you will remember, um, you have an old soul. I get it. But you remember, I have this bracelet. Um, I don't have any grandkids, Kathy. That's a good question, though. Does anybody have grandkids? My oldest is 19, so he better not have no kids, right? All right, so here is the gold bracelet. You might remember that I saw this in silver, okay? So you could, this is the gold bracelet that can go with the gold necklace, okay? And... Yes, this is a blockbuster piece, Melissa. What Melissa means by blockbuster is this is always available. Now, the bracelet is not. They just came out with this bracelet. I was able to snag the gold, okay? And I just got the silver, all right? So if you like the silver one, it's going to coordinate with this, okay? So I have two of the gold bracelet available. And then that necklace comes in those three colors. Vieta, why are you saying, oh, no? Well, for the grandkids, right. My children are too young to have any kind of grandchildren up in this camp. Mm -mm. Better, be, better be learn to keep that pee, pee in your pants. Right? That's number 143. Scarf for attention. Silver. Silver, gunmetal, and gold. 143. All right. 144 up and right. Mm -mm. You have four grandkids, Kathy. Congratulations, girl. I hear it's better. I mean, my boys are pretty good. My boys get uh, straight A's. Only thing I don't like that they do is they like stay in their room now that they're teenagers. When they were little boys, they were like all up under me. And now they're becoming men. So they don't hang out as much, but they are good developing into good men. All right. Number 144, we have the gunmetal hoop. Kind of looks like pressed wires all together. And then I paired it with this necklace in gunmetal. Here it is. So you have the silver circles right there. That's kind of like a pressed coiled wire together. So I thought that hoop would complement those. Well, this is number 144. And then it does have matching earrings. This is the last one of this necklace. It is 
is from the vault. That is number 144. 144. Right. They better not bring no babies up in here. I also tell them don't bring me any trash. If you are going to bring a girl home to your mama, make sure that girl is quality. Okay. Here is number 145, natural bracelet with these wooden beads and a stretch. And then I have a matching necklace called Miss... Nope, wait, hold on. The necklace is gone. There's also this natural cord bracelet. I just put those together because I was like, well, you could totally rock these together, right? That is... Brown bracelet, 145, or black bracelet, 145. No leopard pants? What do you mean by leopard pants? No, no, do not bring that trash in my house, Troy. Okay, Troy, did you see my Z piece? Isn't it gorgeous? That's what I'm modeling today. That's what I'm wearing today. I could roll up in fourth, first grade in my Z piece. Wouldn't that be good? No, no lever pants, no coochie, coochie, coochie catcher. 146 is this gorgeousness. Now, look, perfect for spring, right? We have this. Oh, I'm missing the comments. Five kids. Yes, they are too young to be having kids. All right, here is the next one. And this is perfect for spring. Spring's right around the corner. You can have on your Easter dress, rocking that. Isn't it gorgeous? I would probably drop it down a little bit, okay? <laughs> Melissa, don't be don't be laughing at my jokes. <laughs> That's number 145. 145. 145. All right, we have a few more items to show, and then we's going to bed, people. What time is it? 9.57. Look at me. Boom. Right on time. And it's a cootie, coo coochie catcher. That's right. Don't bring that trash up in my house. Number 148, we got this gold. And it's more like a rose gold. 13, a girl that's going to be eight. And one that's just turned five. Okay, but Kathy, you said you have grandchildren. How do you have four grandchildren? Are you talking about the grandchildren? Please tell me those are your grandchildren. Okay. Here's 148 in the rose gold, and those are really cute, right? 148, and then we have this necklace to go with it. This one I love because you have all that mixed metal, so you have the silver earrings, and then down at the bottom, you have the uh. Okay, good, Kathy. I was scared for a minute. Which did the 13 year old have children already? <laughs> right? Uh, yeah, like the short shorts. Okay, Melissa, that's what those are. Don't bring that up in my house. Here is the necklace you have silver, copper, and gold, and then silver in the center. This to me, it's not a long necklace, medium length chain. So it's going to be right at your bust line. Then you're going to add in these earrings to go with it to bring out that gold color. It's down in the bottom. That's number 148. 148 in rose gold. Right, Kathy? 13. But you know, they start feeling themselves when they get to be 13. My son is 14. I don't know. Oh, they're not at school, so there's not too much drama going on right now, right? Oh, your son is 30. Wow. Wow. So he's married and he's got all them kids. Oh, excuse me. 147 silver earring. Oh, thank you, Mardia. I'm going with a nude lip tonight. 147, 147. I got dressed for y'all. I did my hair for y'all tonight because I definitely did not really get put much effort into what I wore today just around the family. So, and let me show you our last set for the night. And then we's going to bed. For those of you all that hung out the whole time, I appreciate you so much. Melissa is sharing that her oldest is 14. Well, Melissa, we had some coaching today. 
And they were telling us we shouldn't be wearing bright red lips, even though I love my burgundy lipstick. Um, so I'm I'm trying to follow directions. Right, Mardia? We have to follow directions. Okay, so here is the last item of the night. It is red. We have the red and silver beads. Okay, and then you can pair in this red bracelet. Here it is in a stretch with the rhinestones. And then I have one pair of these red rhinestone earrings. So we can totally do these three things together. If you don't like that earring, because you want to tone down a little bit, um, here it is right here with the red. Yeah, yeah. Well, she was saying that if you have on like a bright red lipstick or a bright pink, um, that people pay more attention to your lips than the jewelry. So going with the nude tonight just to see how I like it. Okay, so here is that set with the red and the silver and then the red earrings. Now these just have the little red rhinestone in the center. So you can see how that makes a difference with the outfit. If you put on the other red ones, then you are saying, hello, I am here and I love red, okay? So that is set 149, set 149. You can get the necklace. I have three available of the necklace and three available of the bracelet. I love this stretch. So look, you guys, what I'm saying is I've had on this bracelet all night, okay? But I could totally add in this one and something else and make a nice little uh, eclectic stack going on on my arm, okay? So this red bracelet is number 149 in a stretch. I don't know why it would be echoing in the background. Let me mute myself. All right. So that is set 149. Set 149. Does it sound okay to everybody else? Because I'm only using the mic on the computer. 149. All right, you guys. It is Sunday night. You can shop until Thursday. I will keep your items in your basket. And then you can pay on Thursday. You do not have to have multiple invoices um, for the week. Just let me know. If you feel like you want to check out, you can too. But I will hold your items until Thursday. And I usually invoice on Thursday morning. We will be live again tomorrow two times for our 10-minute flash sale. And then we also have our messenger party tomorrow night. Wait, wait. Yeah, tomorrow's Monday. I got confused for a quick second. When when I look amazing, you buy more. Okay, I well, that's why I have on my Z piece, my dear. Do you see it? It's gorgeous. This is paparazzi right here. Okay, so I will see you guys. If you want to be in the messenger party, just send me a message and I will let you know. This necklace right here is a Z piece. It's $25. It is fabulous. Look, look. It's got little rhinestone beads on it and all different sizes of pearls. So if you want me to order one of you these for you guys, just let me know and I can definitely get them for you. I'm going to try and model more of the Z pieces for you because look, this is fabulous, fabulous. All right, you guys have a great night. Let me know if there's anything you need. Um, Kathy, Shara has an order too. So I hope she'll pick up for you guys this week and Tammy as well. Love you guys. Have a great night. Thanks for hanging out. I will see you this week. Love you. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye.